What's up, what's up, everybody? It's your host, Coach Gonzo, and we are here again with another episode of Madden 22 Budget Beasts. This time, we're talking wide receivers, right? We want to talk about must-have wide receivers in your lineup. Without further ado, man, let's get into it. All right, guys. So first up on our list, we have Will Fuller of the Miami Dolphins. All right, so he's going, you can see the prices here. He's going for about 4.4 on, on Xbox. He's going for about 3 on PS4 or PlayStation. All right, he's 6 feet tall. All right, as you can see, he's a vertical threat. All right, this is what we got. 87 speed. 79 agility. 78 jump. All right, this is where it gets good. 74 catch, right? Remember from our last episode, good, better, best, right? So he falls within that better category with that 74, all right? This is where it gets good. Short route running, 71. Medium, 74. Deep, 78. So he brings a lot to the table, especially for someone who's 3K, all right? So definitely go get your hands on this guy. Um, He's very cheap, very good to put in your lineup early until you can get some of the other guys like the uh, superstars, um, if you have the premieres, you can go and get yourself the chases and the, you know, grind to get the clay pools or whatever wide receivers you want to get. Let's get on to the next one. Chase clay pool, the core version, not the, uh, not the one from the set, from the team builder set, okay? He's going for about 4K on, on Xbox, 3.5 on PlayStation, okay? This guy, he's 6'4". All right, so he has that height, right? And another thing he has, 86 jump. So again, good, better, best. He's within that better borderline best when it comes to jumping. 85 speed, so he has the speed to get out there. 76 catch, all right? And again, we're in that good territory. 72 short route running, 70 medium, 73 deep. Okay, again, not the best, but if you put him out there, he's going to make plays for you. And again, he's cheap. You can't beat the price, right? If your team no money spent, this is where you want to be. You want to be within those small price ranges, getting yourself a great team to go out there and compete. So, number two, Chase Claypool. Go get him. Next up, Devonta Smith, the core rookie of the rookie. He's a six-foot-tall guy. He is a little bit more expensive, 7.4 on Xbox. 6.97 on PlayStation. Mind you, these could change. So again, you can see he's a vertical threat with a 94, but here we go, 85 speed, so he's fast, 80 jump, okay? And now we have 76 catch. On the route running, we're still in the 70s with 73 short, 74 medium, and 72 deep. So he's going to make plays for you, okay? He's not the um, champion... Uh, Devonta Smith, which is like 75 different cores, costs you like 300k to build them or 300k to purchase them. This guy is 7k on on average, and he's gonna pretty much do the job that you need him to do. All right, so go get your hands on Devonta Smith. Uh, looking forward to see some big things from him this year um, with the Philadelphia Eagles. All right, let's get to the next one. So this one right here, um, the reason I got him is because this is more of my budget jump ball guy. And the reason I say that is because you see the price, 1.1, 1.2K on Xbox and PlayStation, right? He has 84 speed, so the speed is still there, right? But he has 87 jump, so he's almost at that 90 tier for 1K, right? You pay 1K, and you got, you got yourself a guy who can jump ball. Right. Obviously, if he's going against extreme DBs, he's going against defensive backs that have great stats. He's not going to come down with that ball, especially with a 67 catch. Right. But he is going to make some plays. His route running, not good. 64 short, 63 medium, 65 deep. But the reason for putting him in here is because he has that big 87 jump stat. So go try him out. Again, he's not going to be the best. But he is a value player, and I think for 1K, he gets the job done. All right, guys. 
This is my last one. And here I have a little bit of a combination of big and just great value. So Corey Davis, to me, was a great receiver over in Tennessee. He's now with the New York Jets. So for me, that's a dud. I am a Dolphin fan, so that's why I say it. But he has 83 speed, 83 jump. Okay. But where his stats get good is that he's 6'3", right? And he has 78 catch. So he's going into that 80s already. Okay. And his route running, 74 short, 73 medium, 71 deep. So with those stats, this guy is going to go out there and he's going to make significant plays for you out the gate, right? And for a value of pretty much 3 to 4K, again, you can't beat that. All right, this guy right here is going to be someone that you want to put in your lineup. All of these guys are someone that you want to put in your lineup to grind solos, to grind whatever it is you want to grind. And if you want to get ballsy and you really want to go out there and play um, weekend league and you want to play head to head, these guys are going to get you a better advantage than if you were just to go with your starter team um, or just build as you go with one great player and useless players at other positions. Go out, do some grinding, grab these guys. And um, as always, man, just make sure that you continue to play the game and have fun, right? If you're playing this game and you're not having fun, then why are you playing? All right, guys. So that's it for five top budget wide receivers. Hope you guys enjoyed. Hope you guys use some of these players to propel you to the next level of your mutt journey. As always, guys, thank you so much for the support. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and hit that notification bell so you know every time a new video goes live. As always, make sure to follow us on Twitch, man, and go live with us every Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. And come vibe with the Coaches Club. Guys, team no money spent doesn't mean you get your butt kicked. It just means you got to make smart decisions with who you put on your team, when you put on, on your team, and when to advance. As always, guys, let me know what you want to see next on the comments. Love to hear your feedback. And as always, man, y'all have a great day. Dolly.